Hello Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 31st. Please do bear in mind that these are general readings so it may not resonate for everybody. Do take what doesn't leave, what doesn't. So for this week I'll be defining through eggshells. Um, I did eggshell readings a number of uh, months ago on my channel in a, in a different way but I still hope you enjoy this one um, and it's a very powerful tool to use um, and to, by spiritual means so i hope you enjoy it and then i'll be pulling out some cards towards the end this is the gilded tarot deck which i have in my description box okay all right aquarius 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 let's begin Something very meaningful was hiding from you. Well, you were hiding behind something for quite some time and now it's time to step into the limelight, step into that spotlight. You, th th I do see something in terms of hiding, hiding from maybe subconsciously from a certain kind of success that you've been um, working towards and you, you know, but there's been some setbacks perhaps and um, maybe uh, hiding behind uh, this particular wall that you have you have had perhaps to not be disappointed. It's like your defense mechanism to not be disappointed. But there is something coming through that is very meaningful to you that will give you that confidence and that courage, the strength to step out into this light and uh, be like, oh, well, why am I hiding? I'm an Aquarius. I know how good I am uh, and you're beautiful and you got to show that beauty. There's something there that it's like, I do see you, you know, the spotlight has been looking for you. Spotlight has been looking and it's like, oh, here you are. Bing. Spotlight is there on you. And, you know, the stage is yours, basically, is what I'm getting here. There's a fruitfulness. There's the, the fruits of your labor is being paid off it's being paid off i think in some unexpected ways also there is certain situations that you found yourself in perhaps it was a little bit um overwhelming overwhelming situations and like i see juggling and having to deal with things um by yourself but i see you're prepared to kind of um now move on from that you're carrying on you are carrying on with a particular kind of work here that you f that you feel good doing, um, but you're also extracting things out of it that you realize was just tiring you. Uh, maybe you're slimming down this work, or you're just cutting out certain certain things. If you, for example, work in in this work environment. Um, there's a realization here what has been um, a little bit of maybe an annoyance that you're cutting out, whether it's a, a colleague or, or where you sit, something like that, you know. Um, also timing here. I, I'm guessing nighttime. Maybe some of you work night shift, you work at night or you like to work at night because things are quieter then. Um, it could be just for the very few of you in terms of working at night um there is it's relaxing for you but also i see you're wanting to maybe uh, change that um pattern as well uh i am getting a specific message here of fruit of apples big apple fruit enjoying that <laughs> eating more fruit uh, that's coming through. I know it's specific and random, but that is um, coming through here. There is um, a somewhere that's pet friendly. You're finding a place that you now can feel happy where you can take your pets. I know it's a specific message, but maybe that's just for some of you. There's something there. You're, uh, there's friendships there. Fr there's budding potential friendships in this place. Um, but I do see you are also ad being more adventurous now as you, you know, um, no longer shy away 
from certain things, um, wanting to go out there and experience. You have certain responsibilities, but you're trying to find a way to manage those responsibilities while also having this flexibility to be able to experience certain things and adventures and whatnot. Um, I'm getting, wow, I'm getting another very specific message of um, a flute, music of a flute or a recorder or something like, and you know, a, a wind uh, instrument that you could be playing. <laughs> I mean, it's specific, but yeah. Um, okay, let's see what the cards have for you. I see a budding romance as well. But there's something you need to finish first or something they need to finish. They need to finish something. If for those of you who are looking for romance, there's something that needs to be completed in order for this to continue. Okay, let's see what the cards have, Aquarius. We have the King of Wands. King of Wands. Ooh. Ah, too many cards. Okay. Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. Aquarius. The Page of Swords. And the King of Swords. Ooh, look at that. King of Wands, Page of Swords, King of Swords. Wow. Wow. King of Wands, Page of Swords, and the King of Swords. There is a, a steadiness there. There is something of a higher power that you know has been guiding you. That's the first thing that I get here. But you are very much always kind of, you know, I've seen some chaos, but you still know how to keep things in check. You still know how to really get on with things, have things in, in, in your control, having things ready. I do see certain uh, presentations I'm getting here with the King of Wands ready to kind of present something. Um, and there's a lot of, a lot of something very, very, um, something that has very high potential coming through for you. It could really, you know, shape things up for you in a different in a different way. That it's it's like your wildest imagination is. You thought maybe you know, oh, that's just in my wildest imagination. But I do feel like something is coming through from things that you once just imagined. And there's an offer coming in here with the Page of Swords that could be very, very tempting for, tempting for you. Very tempting. Um, and there is... I'm Okay, I'm guessing something like about liability issues. As, as soon as that is kind of like uh, ironed out, uh, you're good to go. Something to do with liability. Um, and that needs to just be sorted. Maybe there's just legal stuff. But the, you know, the Page of Swords is is basically welcoming you into this new door that you're entering here with the King of Swords. There is like this, this person you could be um, attracting to uh, advance you onto your path that will help you kind of um, get the things that you need to get all together. There is somebody that, you know, you have here a good balance of creativity and, and a, a business acumen here, you know, business sense, something, somebody logical, but also um, somebody that is not afraid to, to have different ideas somebody that has like you know is open to your creative ideas if that makes sense you know there is something there that you will be able to balance out really really well we have just okay we have the justice card and we have the death card wow justice and the death card you know you could be dealing with very different personalities but it's just how you are able to manage that because you, they need you, you need them. But it's something very, very promising. Something very, very promising. And, um, and a decision to be made also. Because I get like several 
things coming to you and you may have to slim them down and, and decide which one you want to continue with. If it's a romantic connection situation here, you could be having more than one person. One that's, you know, it could be one that's a fire sign, one that's an air sign. But there is, I feel like, um, you know, one leads more with their heart, the other one leads more with their mind. Uh, and I'm getting the one that leads more with the heart. You may go towards that. Um, and with the justice card and the death card, wow. Yeah, something is happening karmically, Aquarius, that's going to really just have a, a, a very big transformative effect on your life here. Things that it, it's like you can't escape it. It's meant to happen. It's meant to happen. Um, it needs to happen to have this 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 death card come through, this transformation that comes through. An ending that is going to be very, very healthy for you. And we have the strength card. The justice card, you know, and um, as I was saying, maybe some legal stuff. We're here with the Page of Swords. I was getting that legal stuff. And I think that's something that you need to also um, sort out, organize, deal with. But also karmically, energetically, there's a huge transformation here. Now we have the strength card. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, by the way, Leo, possibly. If it doesn't, doesn't have to be whatsoever. But the strength card here um, shows how powerful you are, shows that with your courage, with your with your vision, with your strength, you're able to absolutely, you know, accomplish anything. There is high accomplishments here. There is something that maybe you feel like sometimes you're in the middle of, of two people in the middle of things, but once you decide and really go for it, nothing can stop you. Nothing can stop you whatsoever. I see that there's a certain calling out there for you as well. Big transformation, Aquarius, definitely a big transformation. You're coming through out from the hide, from hiding as well. And as soon as you do, there's a lot of tension on you a lot of attention you know and that's when it's like okay now i must decide and it definitely pays off aquarius thank you so very much for being here i hope that you enjoyed it please do like share and subscribe if you haven't done so already i want to thank all of you so much for your support and your donations it means so much to me truly truly does i am eternally grateful and you have no idea how much it helps I, it truly does i love you all very much and until next time